Hello and welcome everybody. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create an ISO file from your CD or a DVD. So the first thing is you need to go to this address, this link, and download an application known as IMG Burn. This is a freeware. You can download by clicking this download button. I'll place this link in the description of the video. I have already downloaded it, so let's begin the installation. Just double click on the setup. and just follow on screen instructions to install IMG burn click on next check this box and click on next leave all the check boxes as it is and click on next select the path where you want to install this program and click next click next uncheck this box click next uncheck this one also and click next Once the setup is completed, you'll get a shortcut on the desktop. Just double click on the shortcut to start the application. One another next step, important step is you need to insert the CD or the DVD which you want to create an ISO from into the tray of your DVD or the CD drive. Just insert a DVD into the tray and then click on this option create image file from disk just click on this and select your DVD or the CD-ROM from here so I'll select my DVD-ROM once you select this it will give all the information regarding your CD or the DVD here you can select the speeds and you can also select the path where you want the output file that's your ISO file so I'll save this on the desktop. You can name whatever you want. I'll give as an DVD ISO file. I'll save this and just click on this to start creating your ISO. Click on this. We'll wait till the complete process is completed. You have different options uh, post installation. If you select this, it will eject the tray. Uh, post uh, the completion and if you select the shutdown computer after the complete process is completed it will shut down the computer or close your program so we'll wait till the complete process is completed so once your process is completed it will give a message of operation successfully complete just click on ok close this box and here you can see that in your destination where you have given the destination for the output image you'll have an ISO file created you can see it's an ISO file it's in dot with an extension dot ISO so in this way you create an ISO file from your CD or a DVD I hope this has been informative for you and I'd like to thank you for viewing Please don't forget to like the video as well as subscribe my channel for the latest tutorials and updates on Windows, Linux, Oracle and Telecom. Once again, thanks for watching.